Hey there, Lunar Baby, and welcome to Friday. And you know what? You might want to stay in this weekend, Cancer. I'm not being facetious. The moon, your ruling planet, is now moving into your subconscious, which means good chance of thunderstorms for you. Not just because it's in your subconscious, that's a given anyways, but because on Saturday in particular, it will conjunct or cross over a retrograde Mars. Let's start with the moon in the 12th house, just generally. When the moon is in this sector of consciousness, the consciousness that Pisces are masters of, by the way. If you know good Pisces, there's always that blank look on their face. That's because they are logged into the universe and the moment at the same time, and that is kind of the synergy of being a Pisces, and that is the synergy of your emotions this weekend. Your heart is kind of in the moment, and your heart is somewhere else. That somewhere else is your subconscious, or the customs between this life and the last life. A lot of times past life issues kind of drip into our consciousness. So that's a setup to be kind of cranky anyways. You probably want to be more alone, you want to meditate in these periods, and you want to pull your wisdom down into your body. Then on Saturday, the universe ain't helping, it will conjunct a retrograde Mars. Now Mars has been retrograde in this sector of your consciousness for some time now, asking Cancers to rethink, react, replay old karmic patterns. Yes, Cancer, that's been the problem. You've been pulled deliberately into an old situation, probably a karmic situation, karmic meaning a clear pattern in your life, the weeds that are in your soul garden, so to speak. And on this weekend, when the moon, your ruling planet, crosses that Mars, that is a real potential flare-up, a thunderstorm, if you will, that really may rock the boat, especially if you haven't given any meditation time to yourself or any time to really kind of let the true consciousness sink in. One other way this tends to manifest as well, if you're super busy in the day and you're working really hard and you're not giving any time to yourself, a lot of times people have some crazy dreams during this particular transit, so I just want to put that out there as well. All right, Lunar Child, that's all I got for the weekend forecast. See you back on Monday. Live, love, be. So good.